today's episode of The Story of Animals, we embark on a journey into the mysterious, ancient world of two of the most feared and fascinating reptiles to walk the earth, the alligator and the crocodile. Often confused with one another, these formidable creatures share a common ancestry, yet their differences are striking. Today, we'll unravel the evolutionary history, physical traits, behaviors, and habitats that set them apart. As we explore the rivers, lakes, and coastal waters they call home, we'll discover what makes these giants of the animal kingdom so unique and how they've managed to survive for over 200 million years. Alligators and crocodiles are living relics from the time of the dinosaurs. Both belong to the order Crocodilia, a group that has been around for over 200 million years with little change in their design. Despite their superficial similarities, these reptiles are remarkably different, and it's these differences that have allowed them to thrive in diverse environments across the globe. But how did they evolve into the specialized predators they are today? To answer that, we must look at their biology, their survival strategies, and the subtle but crucial features that distinguish them from each other. One of the easiest ways to tell an alligator from a crocodile is by looking at their snouts. Alligators have broad, U-shaped snouts resembling a shovel, perfect for their diet of fish, turtles, and other aquatic prey that they crush with ease. Crocodiles, by contrast, sport longer, V-shaped snouts, more streamlined and designed for a different style of hunting. This narrower snout allows crocodiles to snap up fish and birds with precision, making them agile hunters in both freshwater and saltwater environments. The snout, however, is just the beginning of their differences. Look closely at their mouths when closed, and you'll notice another clear distinction. In alligators, the upper teeth are visible but the lower ones are hidden by their upper jaw. Crocodiles, on the other hand, show both their upper and lower teeth, with their notorious fourth tooth on the lower jaw always protruding when their mouths are shut. This toothy grin is a defining characteristic that adds to the crocodile's fearsome reputation. Where these creatures live plays a crucial role in their survival strategies. Alligators are freshwater specialists. In the United States, they thrive in the wetlands, rivers, and swamps of the Southeast, with the Florida Everglades being their most famous home. These freshwater environments are ideal for alligators, which lack the salt glands that crocodiles have for filtering out salt from seawater. Crocodiles, however, are more versatile. They can be found in both freshwater and saltwater habitats. Thanks to their specialized salt glands, crocodiles can inhabit brackish waters and even venture into the open ocean. This ability to thrive in diverse environments has given them a wider range than their alligator cousins, with populations in Africa, Australia, Southeast Asia, and Central America. In fact, the infamous saltwater crocodile is known for traveling vast distances across the ocean, making them one of the most widely distributed reptiles on the planet. While both alligators and crocodiles are apex predators, their temperaments are starkly different. Alligators are typically less aggressive toward humans, especially when compared to crocodiles. They are more likely to flee than fight when encountering people. This doesn't mean they aren't dangerous. An alligator, if provoked or threatened, can be lethal. But in their natural habitat, they tend to avoid unnecessary conflict. Crocodiles, particularly species like the Nile and saltwater crocodile, are notoriously more aggressive. These reptiles are known to attack humans and other large animals with little provocation. In regions where crocodiles live, 
fatal encounters with humans are much more common. Their more hostile disposition stems from their role as dominant predators in their ecosystems, leaving them with fewer natural threats, making them more likely to stand their ground or attack when approached. Both alligators and crocodiles are opportunistic hunters, using the element of surprise to catch their prey. However, their methods and prey can differ. Alligators prefer a diet that includes fish, turtles, birds, and small mammals. Their freshwater habitats often provide them with an abundance of prey that can be easily crushed in their powerful jaws. Crocodiles, on the other hand, are far more versatile in their diet. Thanks to their ability to live in both saltwater and freshwater environments, they can hunt everything from fish and birds to large mammals such as wildebeest and zebras. Crocodiles are ambush predators, lying in wait near water holes where animals come to drink. With astonishing speed, they launch from the water, clamping down on their prey with their bone-crushing jaws. Some larger species of crocodiles, like the Nile or saltwater crocodile, will even drown their prey before dragging it back into the water for consumption. Both alligators and crocodiles have faced significant threats from humans throughout history. Overhunting for their skins, habitat destruction and pollution have all contributed to population declines. As we conclude our exploration of these ancient reptiles, it's clear that while alligators and crocodiles may look similar, they are unique in many ways. Their physical traits, behaviors, and habitats reflect millions of years of evolution, adapting them to different challenges and environments. Whether it's the reserved strength of the alligator or the aggressive prowess of the crocodile, these animals remind us of the incredible adaptability of life on Earth. Both alligators and crocodiles have earned their place as apex predators, and their survival is a testament to the power of nature's design.